Hello everyone, I'm the main developer on UAC, and here's a work session where I'm implementing a particle system. Here I'm implementing the component that's going to hold the different settings of the particle emitter. I'm also making sure I can serialize and deserialize them. I'm now adding a new component panel to the editor where I can modify the particle colors, the life, the amount, and the gravity. I'm then also going to add a new item in the add component menu so I can add the component through the editor. I can then start implementing the particle system. So NewAq uses an entity component system. In this case, component are data and the system are the actual implementation. So in this case, I'm creating a new system where I have emitters that owns particles and every emitter runs the simulation on the particle themselves. and then switched over to the actual behavior of particles. So I added some simple lifetime system. When particles die, new particles can be added. Also added some velocity and gravity simulation, as well as random position for the particles. Now I'm implementing the rendering part. For a star, I simply did some simple quads that always faces the camera. I'm reusing the billboarding logic I did with the sprites. And then I'm simply spawning them at the correct place. The particles were always spawning at the same time, so it was kind of creating a bursting effect, but I also wanted to add uh, a spawning rate system. So a spawning rate is simply a timer that delays how fast the particle emitter can spawn new particles. I then started experimenting with it, seeing how far I can take it. Uh, performance wise, it seemed to be pretty good for a simple CPU particle system. Here I'm just creating random clips that I'm sending to, uh, to my friend.
Implementing particle colors was the hardest part of this work session. I got stuck on some bug in my material system where it was always outputting black. And for some reason, some bit that was saying if it had a texture or not was always set to true, even though I was overriding it. And I actually had to use NVIDIA Insight to try and figure out what was going on. And uh, I ended up fixing it. this small demo scene where I'm where I'm showcasing some raindrops, some toxic fume and blood splatters and this magic beam. Um, I think this is pretty good for a simple particle system. Feel free to check out New Egg on GitHub. We're looking for contributors. The link is in the description. Thank you.